it's a special day today. We are eating this pork. And it's yeah. something your family hasn't had for almost a year. Mm, yes, yeah. Very special day. Yes. And let's also cheers to that. <laughs> Best Ever Food Review Show is back with another food series. This time covering northern Vietnam, courtesy of One Trip Tours. And these next four weeks are going to be magical. Vietnam's northern mountains are populated by many ethnic minorities, and during this journey, we'll get a closer look at how many of them live and how they eat. In this series, I get adopted by a Red Yao family. When we get drunk, we feel very happy. Yeah. Yes. Okay. We'll make some human soup. Wow, I feel like I'm in a giant hot pot right now. We'll get lost in one of the most colorful markets in the world. Banana leaf, the original throwaway plate. And we'll try some rare mountain delicacies. Oh my god, I've never been so happy to have a bee suit on. He just told me to hold this, don't smoosh any bees and don't drop it or else they'll all freak out. So check back each week because we're doing all this and more. Today we're in Ta Fin Village, home of the Red Yao people. And before we eat, I'm getting an exclusive house tour with my tour guide, May. We are at the house of our local guy today. So you grew up here? Yes. Your whole life? Yes. How old are you now? Uh, I'm 19 years old. What we're going to do next is we're going to check out your house. Yes. Which is very exciting for me <laughs> to see how other people live. Um, let's go check it out. Yes. Okay. okay. My first thought when I walked into here was uh, that your house seems huge, but you said this is not a big house? Yeah, that's not so big. Not so big? Yes. Okay, it's a lot bigger than my apartment. Over here, this is like a year's worth of rice. Yes. Why do you have so much rice? In here, we're just planting one time for one year. Oh. Because the weather in here too cold. So other places in Vietnam, they can yes. plant rice two or three times a year and just yes. grow continuously. But yes. here in the mountains, yes. you just yes. have one chance. Yes, that's for the kitchen. Oh, is this your grandma? Yes, see my grandmother. Okay. Yes. Bye. <laughs> we are at the, is this, you'd call this a kitchen? Yes. One family, we have three kitchens. Wow. Three kitchens. Yes. I want three kitchens. The smoke just goes up and out yes. that way? Yes. Go up in here to get dry everything. You're using it to cook, but it's also drying the other food. I like it. Careful. This Look at these okay. like wooden stairs here. Yeah, I can, do you want me to hold it yes. for you? Thank you. Oh God, is this going to... Careful. Uh... Yeah, no, this seems like a good idea. Oh, it's good. Okay, it's sturdy. It's nice and sturdy. Camera guy, you're next. <laughs> <laughs> the first kitchen we saw, the fire from there, actually, <laughs> your grandma's building the fire right yeah, now. <laughs> yeah. So the smoke is coming up. And so now I know what that rice feels like, okay? So the rice, mm -hmm. usually you put here to dry. Yes, yes, but yes. There's no rice here now, is there? Yeah. Oh, this that, is all rice? This is the rice, yeah. You never come up here to drink uh, rice no, wine? No, we never come up here. Okay. Yeah, we got to smoke. They don't care if you drink uh, rice wine? Yeah, no. Really oh, you got yeah. cool parents. <laughs> My parents are lame. Oh, really? Yeah. And your father helped build this? Yes, the boy and the man in here, hmm. about 18 years old, they know how to build in the house. All right, here you've got these giant wood tubs. You said this is for a leaf bath? We use the local medicine to okay. make herbal bath. When we walk the field, we feel very tired. Mm. We have herbal bath, uh, then we feel very better. And then there's one more kitchen over here? Yes. All right, let's look at that one. So right here is your third kitchen. This is the drying technique right yes. here, the corn. Uh, this we just get the animal. Oh. We get the pig and the chicken. But right here, <laughs> we have the fire pit. This one is for the winter? Yes, for the winter. You actually get winter mm -hmm. and snow here. Yes. Can you like make a snowman? No, we, we, don't, we, we don't make that. Well, okay. Can you make it, do like a snowball fight? Yes. Okay, yeah. yeah. Look, we got snowball <laughs> fights. Thank you for showing me your house. Can you tell me what's for lunch? Yes, now we go to the forest to find some pig to make the food, to That's make right. the lunch, yes. We're going to the forest to find a pig. Yes. All right, pig time, let's go. Thought you'd be the one for me Won't you tell me how you feel Right now what we're doing is called uh, trekking. <laughs> it's a fancy word for walking up a hill. We're having pig today. How often uh, do you have pig? Uh, we in here, we just eat meat for the special day. Maybe uh, we have... Um, Four times for one year. Wow, this could have almost been a vegan video. That's so special. We get to have a pig together today. We're having a lot of fun trekking and your mom is up here. Oh, is she okay? All right. Yeah. She's getting some fruit? Yes. There's food all along the way. I'll get up and eat uh, well, look at that. Yes, eat the rest of it. I've never seen a fruit like this. So this is like a berry? Is there a seed inside? Yeah, you just bite it. This. Just bite. Okay, you ready? Yeah. One, two, three. Oh. 
Oh, I did the whole thing. Was that, did I do it too much? Sour. It's like a skinny grape. Have you had grapes? <clears throat> have you ever had McDonald's? No. Oh I my don't. God. <laughs> I wish I would have brought you a Big Mac. <laughs> Everybody watching this video hates me now. So you've never had a taco? What about a taco? No, we don't have that. Can I eat the seed? No, no, you cannot eat it. Oh. <laughs> She's like, man, this guy is such a noob. <laughs> Look, I don't know what I'm doing. That's why you're here. Let's keep going. That was good. Okay. I really, really, I just wanted to take a break from all this walking. I mean, yeah, let's keep going. I'm not tired at all. <laughs> <laughs> Tell your mom I can talk to ghosts. <laughs> no, he said go away. I like your bell. Oh. Really? I'm a guest. I'm a guest here. We're going to catch a pig or is the pig caught already? <laughs> we have to catch the pig. <laughs> we have to catch it ourselves? I'm really good at catching chickens. Gotta be stealthy. It's on. <laughs> but I never tried to catch a pig. There's a pig right up here. It looks like a wild boar. Up here. Oh, I hear pig noises. Two kilometers trekking through the... Tr well, you saw the train. And now here we are. I hear some pigs. Let's go... Let's go say hi. <laughs> is your... Is your mom saying hi? What is this sound? My mom called the pig. And they still come? Even though we're going to eat them? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. Do pigs bite? Hey, why can't I pet you? Feeling rejected. I guess they're young pigs. I think we're having a young pig today. I don't know how much of this we can show. You know, the rules for YouTube are, it doesn't matter if it's a real culture and what they actually do. It just matters if someone, you know, in New York has their feelings hurt by it. This is a very new experience for me. We climbed two kilometers. We're at the top of a mountain. What, what are we doing? Now we go to the catch the pig. Do they have like a handle? <laughs> or we're gonna catch the pig, yes. put it in a basket, and yes. walk it back two kilometers yes, yeah, to your yeah, house. Yes, yeah. And then from there, no one knows what happens, but it turns into food. <laughs> Let's go catch a pig. I've done this before. If I catch this pig right here, what will you give me? I get to eat it for free? Yes, okay, <laughs> yes. But I think you cannot cut for this pig because it's run very fast. Oh, what the heck? It like knew it was on camera. Okay, so right there, we see the pig. The pig suspects nothing. It does not know that there is a crazy hunter. Oh, I took one step this way and it ran away. <laughs> I wasn't even close to it. I think it, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, uh-oh, do you see it? Do you see it, guy? Oh, no! Why is it so shy? Oh, there's one right there. I'm gonna go for it. Come here! Come here, Mickey! Oh, I was so close. Did you see me? Yeah, like I grabbed it by the foot and then it like kicked me and it called me a bad name. Oh my gosh, I was so close. It looks like they, somebody caught some already. This might be better. It's time to get some vegetables to round out our meal. And the garden is... Oh, are the vegetables here? Yes. Oh, th this is the vegetable section right here, the produce section. Right now, we're picking vegetables for our meal. Um, okay, I should say they're picking vegetables. I'm more just kind of hanging out. But look, you need me to catch a pig? I can do that. You need me to catch a vegetable? I've never done that before. But they're good at it. You did a wonderful job with your mother picking all these vegetables. Yeah. And now we're we're gonna prepare them and we're gonna eat them? Yes. Can I eat it now? No. Okay. We have to cook. Be patient. I have a question about your outfit. Mm -hmm. Is this like a traditional outfit? Yes. Is yes. this something that you actually wear, like normally? For the special day when I go to the wedding or mm. New Year, or I wear for this costume. Uh. Or I go to the outside my village, I also wear for this costume. You're 19. You said that you're you're old. Yes, in my village, everyone thinks 
I mean, very, very old lady. Because many people in my village, they get married very, very early. How, 19 years old. How down. early? 19, how, how much earlier uh, than 19? 14 or 15 years old, they already to get married. And 19 years old, they already, already to have one or two kids. Oh my gosh. <laughs> what was I doing? I couldn't even drive a car. In my culture, if I want to get married, my parents uh, can find husband help me. But I don't like that, oh. and I don't want to get married uh, early. Maybe in the future, I, I can find another guy or... Mm. Yes. If you find somebody, mm -hmm. will your parents be okay with that? Yes, maybe that's the, the, the okay. So when the parents set you up with another guy, mm -hmm. what do they look for? What kind of qualities? He know how to work the right field and corn field. He know how to find the wood to build the house. That's my parents say, oh, you are a very good boy. They think this that. Is so and, yeah. fascinating. It feels so different, but then so many familiar things too. I mean, there's people still using cell phones, you're on Facebook, but then at the same time, everyone here is still living very traditionally. Yes. Yeah. There's still people having arranged marriages, and the qualities they're looking for in a partner are like, can you build a house and grow some rice? But if you're looking for a guy, do you care about if he can build a house? Mm, or what I'm do not you sure. what do you care about? Uh that's for the beef. Uh, I think uh, if uh, I can find the guys and I love him, I can get married with him mm. because um, maybe uh, I want to change a little bit for my culture. Mm. Yes. So maybe just find a nice guy. Yes. Someone you really like. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Uh -huh. Maybe he he don't know how to find the wood to build the house. <laughs> but that's okay. That is okay. As long for as me. you like each other. Yes. Mom here is hard at work. The pig we got today, it's not your standard like in industry farm raised pig. What's special about that yeah. pig? Before we fried that pig on the forest and then we have to feed them. So those are wild pigs, but you just feed them. Yes, yes. And then get them comfortable with you. Yes, yes, exactly. And yes. then once in a while you eat one and they kind of forgive you. Yes, yeah. As long as you keep feeding them. Yeah. Oh. Right here we have our boiling pork. This is also for the pork, but we have to fry. Fried. And then this is being barbecued. Is that the skin? Yes, this is for the skin, yes. Oh, yes. it looks good. Are you excited? Are you hungry? Let me see. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Hungry. Dinner is almost ready, but we can't have dinner without a place setting. And there's some growing on this tree over here. Are we getting some banana leaves? So you have to cut for this tree, okay? This is a mean machine right here. Look at that. So I just hit it hard? Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, that is crazy sharp. Okay, I didn't know it would cut so easily. One. Oh, oh no, it's dirty. I wasted a whole plate. Oh, come here, come here, come here. Oh, nice okay. and clean. Before we don't have the bowl, uh. we use this like the bowl to eat to eat something. Oh, just to eat rice. right off of there. Yes. Look at this. This is our placemat for dinner. That's awesome. You know, you better you better take this from me because I'm gonna hurt somebody. All right, thank you. <laughs> Here, the food is done, it looks amazing, and you are raring to go with this rice wine, so you do not have to wait any longer, my friend. Let's do it. Rice wine time. Ooh, yeah, buddy. First, I, I want to okay. say thank you so much mm -hmm. for bringing us together to make this incredible meal, and uh, I can't wait to try it. How do you say thank you in your language? Touching. Touching. Yes. Okay. Touching. Touching. So, how do you say cheers? Cheers, Zo. Zo. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> How do you feel? I feel so happy. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I can't believe how much came from that kind of smaller sized pig. There's so much food here. Can we talk about what some of this is? Uh-huh, yes. A boiled pork. Pork with the uh, shell uh, bamboo soup. Intestine. What is the black part though? Uh, with the uh, mushroom. Oh, this is mushroom? Yes, and um, this barbecue. That looks really nice. And, uh, cheers. Ding. Ding. Cheers. Ding. Zo. Zo. <laughs> <laughs> you ever try mixing that with Diet Mountain Dew? Actually, in my culture, when we drink rice wine, we do both. One person we can drink about three or four bowls. Before they die? No, 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 we don't die. <laughs> when we get drunk, we can go to sleep. Oh, oh my god, there's more food. <laughs> How, all of this is from that one ah, pig? This is for the fry. Ah, the fried yeah, one. So we've also added the fried pork right yes. here. So this is the pork intestine. Yes. Yeah. Okay, and who cleaned this? 
My father. Okay, I trust you. <laughs> I trust you with my intestines. I saw yeah. him in there. All right, let's try it out. How do you feel? It's really excellent. Mm-hmm. Mmm, long. <laughs> long. That's really tremendous. It's very <laughs> salty. It's a little bit chewy. It is not gamey. No strong, like, animal smell. It doesn't smell like uh, the locker room of a, a bunch of pigs after they played basketball, you know? <laughs> yes. It just, it smells good. As we eat, I wanted to ask you a couple other questions. <laughs> One of the kind of defining features of the Red Yao people mm -hmm. is what we see with uh, the shaving of the yeah. eyebrows and the uh -huh. hair. Where does that come from? Oh, that's uh, in my culture. Mm. If we get nervous, we have to shave the hair in here and brow here. If we shave the hair here, that's make we lucky for the future. You'll be lucky. Yes, yes. You know, a lot of people comment on my videos. They mm -hmm. say they can't see my eyebrows. Oh. Do you think that's kind of lucky? Uh, I don't know. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> yeah. All right. <laughs> yeah. Cool. Tomorrow my mom will shave for you. Okay, I'm gonna think about it. Check this out. Your dad's just doing a tuk tuk. Yo, your dad knows how to party. <laughs> Look at this guy. He's like rice wine, pork, tuk lao. He is in heaven right now. <laughs> oh, that was a monster hit, bro. Do you ever do the tuk lao? Just uh, for the men, only men. Oh, yeah. Oh, that seems kind of sexist. I feel like women should smoke too. He loaded up another one right away. A double hitter. Wait, is he going for the triple hit? Is he going for the turkey? Oh, oh, God. <sighs> I don't want to be impolite. <clears throat> I'm just going to do it a little bit. <laughs> I mean, are you sure you don't want to try? I think it would be a step forward for equality <laughs> if the women also tried. <laughs> oh, I'm dizzy. You have to eat for the sun food here. Is this one? Yeah. I like green food. <laughs> okay, more wow. rice wine? Yeah. Yo, you guys know how to party. Do you want to do the bowl? To drink rice wine? <laughs> No, I really don't. I don't. I need to draw a line somewhere. If you feel, uh, you do this, that's you're very lucky. Yeah, you know, you have a lot of stuff related to luck. I feel like you're just making stuff up at this point. <laughs> you keep killing it over there. We're going to come back to the food. We're going to come back to the food. There you go, Kai. We've got this beautiful... Oh, you just handed it to me. I love this guy. Delicious fried pork. <laughs> Guys, look at me. I'm a machine. I'm buzzing hard off of Tuk Lao, and I still keep the food show a rolling. Let's go. Let's try it out. Mmm. Be careful the bone. Mmm. I just eat the bone. That is tremendous. Oh my gosh. Who made this rice wine? <sighs> My father. Seriously, it is so impressive. You're like a renaissance man. No, you're not like a renaissance family. Together, you guys can grow your own food, yes. build your own house, yes. get your own water, yes. make rice wine, uh, get texts or phone calls. Yeah. <laughs> All of that together. That's amazing. This one is the barbecued yeah, the pork. Yeah, barbecue, yes. All right, let's try it out. Mm. There's lemongrass, yeah. right? Uh, that's mm. not lemongrass. No. Uh, lemon leaf. I'm so blown away. I look at this table. Hey, hey, we're making a food show. I'm yeah, even the cat is jealous. <laughs> that's how good this meal is. This cat is down here like, yo, yeah, I mean, yeah. can you give me a foot or something at least? <laughs> I'm starting to understand no matter where I am in this country, never doubt Vietnam and never doubt the quality of food and cuisine and kind of uh, passion that goes into making everything. You know, I love food in Saigon, and that's where I've had most of my Vietnamese food, but even being way out here, this isolated area, way up in the mountains of Vietnam, the food is, is tremendous. I can't believe it. Thank you so much for this experience. We're gonna eat the rest of this off camera. Mm. Yeah. Thank you. Come on, Ji. Thank you. Come on. And thank you so much. And for you guys, if you're looking for an amazing way to experience the real Vietnam, let me tell you about One Trip. One Trip is a company putting on tours all over Vietnam, currently in Saigon, Da Nang, and Hoi An. From food tours to adventure tours, One Trip has you covered. For more information on One Trip, check the links in the description down below. I will see you next week. Peace.